Hello everyone. I'm Dr. Asma Alia Muhammad Buhari and today I'll be discussing about sustainable construction in the context of Malaysian construction industry. Here are the lecture contents for today. I really hope all of you enjoy the video. Construction industry is essential in providing physical development for nation to cater for education, housing, retails, and manufacturing purposes. Construction industry is one of the key important drivers in stimulating Malaysian economic growth, striving for a high-income developed nation, inclusiveness, and sustainability by the year of 2020. However, construction industry is, is always being associated with environmental degradations. The adverse impact of the construction sector on the natural environment has triggered a growing awareness on the need for sustainability. Sustainable construction Sustainable construction is the creation and the responsible maintenance of a health built environment based on ecological principle and by means of an efficient use of resources. At United Nations Climate Change Conference, Malaysia has ratified to reduce the carbon emission intensity by 40% of GDP by the year 2020 compared to 2005 level. Sustainable construction should also be able to enhance living, working, and leisure environment for individuals and communities, and also for future generations, and integrate this built environment with the natural environment. One of the efforts that being introduced is a controlled production environment. Government emphasized on the reduction of reliance on the foreign labors and the ability of off-site manufacturing to deliver the coal. The ability to reuse material from one modular or product into another is the sustainability agenda. Several aspects of planning off-site manufacturing in terms of materials management and production management is being highlighted to achieve the sustainability agenda. Modern method of construction MMC is term adopted in UK to describe a number of construction methods which differ from traditional construction. Other terms that commonly used include off-site construction, industrialized system, and prefabrication system. There are a few types of MMC available. The first one is known as the volumetric construction or PV, PPVC. is a construction method whereby freestanding three-dimensional modules are completed with internal finishes, fixtures, and fittings in an off-site prefabrication facility before it is delivered and installed on site. The second one is the panelized construction is a method of uh, building certain parts of a house in factory rather than on site. The construction method is the natural midpoint between a standard stick built home and completely modular pre-manufacturer home. The third one is known as the hybrid construction. Hybrid construction is a method of a construction which integrates precast concrete and cast in situ con concrete to make best advantage of their different inherent quality. 
the accuracy, speed, and high-quality finish of a precast component can be combined. However, it needs a great care with this type of construction and it is slightly difficult when the client using different contractors. And the fourth one and the last one is the sub assemblies. It requires a large components of a construction project are made off site and are brought to site to be fitted. Traditionally, um, built as a structural form, for instance, a it consists of a prefabricated foundation where ground beams and other key components can be constructed off site. Industrialized building system is being introduced in Malaysian construction industry and become a very important practices in Malaysia. There are five types precast concrete frame building formwork system, steel framing system, prefabricated timber framing, and blockwork system. Modular IBS and sustainability contributes to a sustainability by producing less waste, high quality products, reducing damages towards the environment and ecosystem, less air pollution, sound pollution, and safety on site can be increased that's all for today. If you have any question, drop me an email at asmaalia at uitm.edu.my. Till then, have a nice day.